guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are brand new. My name is Madison and I'm so happy you're here. Today I actually have a Dollar Tree haul and it's from multiple chips over the past like week and a half or so since the last time I did a Dollar Tree haul. I'm really excited to bring some of these items to you. I crossed off so many items off of my wish list, but yeah, it is still mega long. So I don't know what in the world Dollar Tree gets me every single time. They have been impressing me so much more recently than normal with all of their food items, all of their decor items. My store started to bring out some Christmas things. I got a couple of Christmas things. I know, crazy, but I have to get it now because I don't know if I'm ever going to see it again and I'm kind of switching up my whole Christmas decor this year and so I'm pretty much starting from scratch so I need to start picking up stuff now so it's not overwhelming when I get to December. But all that to say I have a super amazing Dollar Tree haul for you guys. I'm really excited with the items that I found so let's get right in before this video becomes so long. Okay I was able to organize all the things I got into categories so it's not all as overwhelming and so it can go a little bit faster. So I'm going to start with my favorite finds of this haul which were the canvas arts you guys I went a little bit crazy as Nicole Burgess would say I got canvas art wasted you guys I love these canvas arts from the Dollar Tree like I take higher end pieces and then mix them in with this and it creates just such a beautiful gallery wall in my home I'll actually insert a picture here of one of the things that I made I showed it in my fall decor tour if you've missed that I'll leave that in the cards as well but I took some pieces from Hobby Lobby and Target and mixed it in with Dollar Tree and Dollar General pieces and I'm so happy with how it came out. So once I saw how much I loved that, I could not wait to get my hands on more canvas arts and Dollar Tree did not disappoint. I saw two full cases at my store and I was so happy that I FaceTimed Kira from Fifty Shades of Mom. She has been looking for these canvases as well. So I FaceTimed her and we got to go through all of them. There were probably like 20 or 25 different ones and we got to go through all of them and pick the ones that we liked the most. So I do have duplicates of some of these but I put them off to the side. I just have one of each of the ones that I got here. So this one says live simply and be grateful. I love this one a lot. I'm going to try to keep the glare off. Um, but I absolutely love this one. It has the faux white wood and then the gray on the top and bottom. I actually already have this one and it's in the gallery wall that you just saw but I am so obsessed with this that I had to get another one. I don't think this one's for Kira. I don't think Kira picked this one out but I'm just going to keep it for a future giveaway or for Christmas. I think these are so high quality and look so much more than a dollar but this one just says bless our nest with like the greenery around it. This one says happy family happy home. I love it with the gray in the back. I actually just redid my bathroom into like a gray kind of farmhouse gray theme so I think this would fit really well in there. This one says do what you love and it has cotton stems and I'm taking all of the cotton stems I can get because I never was able to find the actual cotton stems. Yes I know I could never find them. I have three stores around me and I went to more than that to try to find them and I could never find them. But anyways this has the cotton stems on it so I was happy to get this one and it just says do what you love. This one's my absolute favorite again with the cotton stems and it just says love is the answer. How sweet is this picture like you guys. I saw this and I was like wow blown away and it does have the cotton stems on it. Um, I absolutely love this. I got one for me and one for Kira. This one says begin each day with a grateful heart. Again with the farmhouse is crazy right now at the Dollar Tree. This one's simple it just says home sweet home. And besides the cotton stem ones, I think this one's my favorite because of how simple it is. It just says family right here and then it says together is my favorite place to be. And it kind of has like the white wood in the background. I absolutely love these canvas arts. I think they are absolutely beautiful and for a dollar you really can't beat it. Okay, the next thing I was really excited to find were these Star Wars, um, like little, they're like little helmets, I guess, but they're on, if you could see, they're on a stand, a clear stand right there, so you could display them. So I know nothing about Star Wars, so I don't even know what these people are, but my boyfriend really, really likes Star Wars, and I was able to pick up um, five of them. They're numbered on the side, you can see here. That's number one, obviously, and they have one through six. My store was missing number four, and I went to two different stores, and both of my stores had all of them except for number four. So not, I'm not sure if Dollar Tree is just not getting number four. I haven't watched enough Dollar Tree hauls, and I haven't 
seen anybody haul all of them, but I went ahead and picked up one, two, three, five, and six for him, and I'm going to wrap them all together. So when I saw these, I was like, man, that's really cool to have a Star Wars thing in the Dollar Tree, and there's two helmets in there. And they're kind of like, I don't know if they're a collectible item, I don't know, but it says Disney on the back. I scanned it in the Walmart app, and they're regularly almost $15. They're on clearance or rollback right now at Walmart for $8 and something, but I get it, got it for a dollar. Like, wow, a dollar. And we looked them up on Amazon, and they're like going for $20 something dollars on Amazon, and so I went ahead and got this for him. So this is number one. This is number two. It says the names down there as well. This is number three. And then we skip number four and go to number five. And then the last one is number six. So again, I was really excited to see those. I think that's going to be a really good Christmas present for him. So if you have a Star Wars lover in your life that you are trying to buy presents for, make sure you check the toy aisle and look out for those. And let me know if you find number four or if Dollar Tree is just not carrying that one. Okay, speaking of gifts, I bought a couple of gift supplies, like gift wrapping supplies. My store have not, has not got the Christmas stuff out yet, but I needed a couple of these for a birthday. So this one just says celebrate and it kind of has the raised right here. And this is the side has balloons on it. And then on the inside, it's just a blue color. So I got that. I got this wrapping paper, which is like a corally orange color. I don't know if it's coming across on camera, but it's like a coral, really, color. And then I got this bow on top. So I figured those two would look really pretty together if I wrapped it in this and then put this on top of it. Then, of course, I got the tissue paper. I always get the tissue paper from the Dollar Tree. And this is my favorite set. Um, it's the one that has like the pastel type of colors. I absolutely love those colors. And then I got this for my good friend Vanessa from Lemonade Mom. It's actually a two pack. One is like plaid like that and this one has lemons all over it. There was also a cherry one that kind of had a red theme instead of a yellow theme. But all the girls except for Kira are flying into the Atlanta airport and I'm picking them all up for our beach trip. Or our beach trip. For our trip in Savannah and I wanted to give them just a little something when they get off the plane just to welcome them to Atlanta and all of that stuff so I'm gonna put hers in this because it was absolutely way too cute to pass up you guys there is still so much more stuff here that I'm so excited I can't even decide what to do next but I think we're gonna go ahead and get into the food and then we're gonna get into the health and beauty stuff you guys so so excited to show you what I found Okay, it has been brand name galore down the food aisle at my store. Um, I did end up getting these Kraft Jet Puffed Pumpkin Spice Marshmallows. I think they're the cutest things in the entire world because they are pumpkin shaped. I don't know if you can see one. There we go. They are pumpkin shaped and I think they're so adorable. I've been really, really, really into coffee lately and I never liked coffee before so I don't know what's going on but um, I thought if I put a couple of these in my coffee that would taste pretty good or if I have hot chocolate or something or whatever. I just thought these were so cute I couldn't pass them up. So again, the pumpkin spice and they are craft brand so we all know that's a good brand. Speaking of pumpkin, I did get two cans of pumpkin. So the reason I caught this, I don't have any plans of using it anytime soon um, that of a recipe that I know of already. But last year, I saw these at Dollar Tree and I skipped on them because I was like, oh, I'll never need pumpkin. But then a couple of weeks later, I needed pumpkin for our recipe and the Dollar Tree was out of them and I had to spend $3 or whatever it was to get pumpkin. So the expiration date on this is January 12th 2021 so I figured if I had two cans because they're a little bit smaller than the can I needed for the recipe so I went ahead and picked up two because these are good all the way until 2021 and I'm sure they will get you good use before then you guys have probably seen these hauled already but these are the Ellie's everything bagels my store had cinnamon raisin original and everything but I have been really into everything bagels ever since I had one at Kira's house um, so I got this and this is a four pack of bagels for a dollar so I went ahead and got two packs because I figured that was a pretty good deal I know they're probably not going to be as great as the one I had at Kira's but they will definitely do and for a dollar that is a super awesome deal Speaking of an awesome deal, I'm not sure if this is an awesome deal. This is the pure vanilla extract. So all the time at Dollar Tree they have the 
imitation vanilla extract in the bigger bottle. Um, but around the holidays, they typically get in a pure vanilla extract. This is how big it is. It is 0.5 ounces. So you guys let me know if this is a good deal, but I figured it would be good to have this on hand. Um, and you can't typically find it at the Dollar Tree. So if you see these, this, I would definitely pick it up if you don't use vanilla too often. Okay, this next thing I know is a super amazing deal. I try to, I'll try to find a price of a comparable item at Walmart and stick a picture here. But these are the Austin Cheddar Cheese Crackers in the six pack. So this is just the ones that just have six crackers per container. Each one of them is 1.38 ounces. But there are six in there, which I think is a super amazing deal. So I went ahead and got two of them because my boyfriend loves these crackers. And they're a lot more than a dollar at the store. And then I got this Intamin's Hot Chocolate. So I thought of my girl Kira. I know I keep talking about her, but um, she always talks about how much she loves Intamin's. So when I saw this, I thought of her. I actually picked up three of these because I just got a Keurig and I'm all about putting anything in there. And I think these are going to be delicious. My boyfriend's not a huge coffee person and I'm not, I haven't been until recently, but I figured we would both get use out of the hot chocolate so I picked up a couple of those for this season because it is finally starting to cool off here in Georgia okay one more food item this is the McTrader's strawberry preserves so it does say made in Egypt there's always some sort of strawberry jelly or preserves at the Dollar Tree but I had never seen this brand I know we hauled a salsa of this brand not too long ago so I'm really excited for um, this, I hope this will be good. If you guys have tried it, let me know. But this is the only flavor I saw. But I figured 18 ounces for a dollar was a pretty good deal. Okay, that is all the food. But I do have some coffee mugs. Um, so these I just thought were so cute. When I saw them, I was like, yes. So as you guys know, or maybe not know, I have a cat. And I absolutely love her. And so I found these cat mugs. And I got one for me and one for my boyfriend. I don't know if he'll use it. But this one says, I meow you. And it has just the little cats on there. I think that is the cutest thing in the entire world. And then this one says, I love cats with the little fishies and the cat whiskers. I seriously... When I saw these, I was like, um, yes, please. Okay, Dollar Tree sometimes gets out the reusable coffee mugs, like the to-go reusable coffee mugs. And they just came out with some more. This one says, sip and relax. It is a two-pack. And these are really, really nice. I use these all the time for coffee or whatever, tea or whatever I'm drinking. But this is, like, these are really, really good. So to have one that says sip and relax, that is so cute. There was other ones. I will try to insert pictures here of what the other ones looked like. But these are the only ones that I got. I just thought it was so, so cute. Okay, now let's get into the Christmas items. I only got three things, um, and they're all ornaments. <laughs> but I this year, I'm going to be going with kind of the rustic farmhouse burlap. But also, I really, really like the buffalo check that's been going around. So I'm trying to get my hands on anything buffalo check because I think I'm going to do a lot of my decorations in the white, burlap, and buffalo check. I think that's my thing. I've been really liking the buffalo check things I've been seeing recently. So this is not buffalo check, but this is just a white bell. You can hear it. Actually, it has a thing in it. Um, and then on the top, it has two little mini pine cones, some greenery, and this burlap ribbon. I absolutely love this. I think it's going to be so pretty on the Christmas tree. And then these are kind of close to Buffalo Check. They're more like a plaid. I don't know. But they reminded me of Buffalo Check and I think it is so cute. It just has the background. It's just on a cardboard. But then it has, this one has a snowflake with the holly berries at the top and this one has a reindeer. So all of these are going to look so good on my tree and I'm so excited for Christmas. Okay, I got three kind of household cleaning items. First thing I got were this Good and Clean disinfectant, wipe, disinfectant Wipes in the Lemon Scented. This does have the 45% more, so I don't use these too, too much, so I don't stock up whenever I see them. But I do try to buy one at least when I see the 45%, because a lot of times it'll say 25% more. But in this one, instead of 24 wipes, you get 35, which is a super amazing deal for a dollar so always be looking for the bonus packs at your stores then i got just some scrub buddies printed scrub sponges i need to order the ones from grove that i typically get but i haven't placed a grove order in a while um the cellulose and walnut ones i need to order those but until then i just got these regular ones to hold me over and i think i heard nicole burgess talk about these i'm pretty sure a while back but these are the Sure Fresh cover-ups, and there's five small, eight medium, and seven a large, and you just put them over 
like a bowl to keep everything fresh. So I've never seen these at my store honestly until today. So I went ahead and picked this up because I'm pretty sure Nicole likes these. Around this time, every single year, Dollar Tree comes out with their Snuggadoo 2 Super Soft Socks. And I always pick up a couple of pairs because I like snuggly socks and I like to put them in like spa baskets and stuff like that for family members and friends Christmas presents. So I just got this one. It's just the gray and white. These are probably for me. And they have the little grippers on the bottom. I think these are so cute and they are really, really soft. These also might be for me. I really like these as well. They're just black, but you can see they have like a sparkle in them. I think they're so pretty. I got these ones, which, okay. These are for me too, but um, this is just a blue and white, and then it has a little kitty cat at the bottom. So cute. And then these, I like these because they're shorter. So you can see that these ones are come up a little bit longer on the ankle. These are lower down, and they're just a gray and white stripes. So if you like cozy socks, make sure you check out the Dollar Tree because these are pretty good for a dollar. I found some car air fresheners. These are Essential Blends car air fresheners. Um, and they, they are the Armor All, Armor All brand, so I'm pretty excited about these. My store had so many different kinds. I'll insert pictures here, but this is just the Hanging Diffuser, and this one's the Lemon Bergamot. I'm going to try to smell it. it. Smells really, really good. So, got that one. And then I got the Eucalyptus Mint in, with made with essential oils. This one smells really, really good. So, I'm hoping that these are good in the car because they smell really really good you guys I am so excited about this next item so these are the flower sacks that the Dollar Tree have gotten out recently there were so many I could not decide which one I wanted but I narrowed it down to four I think there was seven all together um, but this one says eat drink and be thankful with a little hot cocoa or a coffee or whatever you want that to be and then the back just has leaves on it I think it is so stinking cute so I picked that one up this one says, for the love of coffee, I'm not sure if I'm going to give this as a gift or keep it for myself, but if you can see up close on the back, it has small gold and black hearts on it, and the front just has the words with a little coffee cup. This one was one of my favorites. This says, all about that baste with a little turkey on there, and then the back is kind of like a white with just yellow kind of, looks like paint strokes, honestly, but... Um, I absolutely love this one. It's so stinking cute. And then this one was my all-time favorite. It says, watch me whip with the little whisk on there. And I just think that these are absolutely so cute. Like, how can you beat stuff like this for a dollar? Like, I don't know if I'm going to keep these, like I said, or give them as gifts. But either way, you can't go wrong. Okay, guys, and we are almost to the end. So I have a couple of more things and my absolute favorite thing besides those canvases is coming at the end so make sure you stay tuned the first thing that I want to show you guys is this Revlon shampoo and conditioner so obviously I don't have brown hair my store didn't have the blonde one but they had the brown so I picked up one set for my mom and one set for Kira because I was on the phone with her and she said she hadn't seen them this is just the color stay nourishing uh, shampoo and conditioner it says provides shine gorgeous brunette so I picked these up one set for each of them and I'm super excited about that what's a Dollar Tree haul without fake nails I don't even know but the, I already have this set I think but I went ahead and picked up two more because I really like it I did get two makeup brushes this is a powder brush and a concealer brush in like the unicorn mermaidy brushes Okay, we're down to my last item, and I'm so, so, so excited. When I turned the corner and saw these, like, my jaw, like, dropped to the floor. Like, I'll show you pictures of the other ones that I didn't pick up, but I think I picked up at least one of each of them. Maybe not, but they are the Yes to Face Mask. Like, look, you guys. What in the world? So they had a new shipment of the Yes to Cotton ones. My store also had a Yes to Coconut something. But I picked up the Yes to Tomatoes DIY Powder to Clay Mask. It says uh, mixing bowl and spoon included. So I'm assuming that you put it in the little bowl and add water. And it says there's a bunch of different things you can add to it. You leave it on for 10 minutes. And you can, there's a bunch of stuff you can add to it for more moisture. But... Um, I figured this was pretty good for a dollar. This is the Yes to Grapefruit 
brightening a sleeping mask. My store had so many of all of these. This is the Yes to Tomatoes DIY Powder to Clay Mask. I guess this is the same as this one, but it's two different packagings. So there's that. And then I think I'm going to like these the best, so I picked up multiples of these. This is the Yes to Cucumbers, and I got three of the DIY Powder to Clay Masks in this one, and two of the Calming Sleeping Masks. So these are such a good deal for a dollar, you guys. Like, I cannot get over it. Those would be like $2, $2.50 at the store. The fact that you can get them at the Dollar Tree is absolutely crazy. Like, when I saw that in the aisle, I was like, no. No way. And they have, like, a whole display. I'll show you guys, like I said. But I was so, so happy to find them just for a dollar. Okay, just out of curiosity, I want to know what the number one thing on y'all's wish list is. I really don't know mine because I found a lot of mine. Probably right now, it's either the Cotton Stems. Oh my goodness, don't even get me started on that. Or number four out of that Star Wars, Star Wars series. I definitely want to find both of those things. But let me know what your number one wish list item is in the comments below. Thank you guys so, so much for watching this Dollar Tree haul. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.